two empty tubs and they're all in there safely so I mean if you're squeamish about insects that's the best way to actually do it because you're not really getting them on you and I use a big tweezers reptile tweezers which I get the rest of them in that are sort of stuck in sometimes you get a few left in the box but it's pretty straightforward when you know how I used to absolutely hate insects that was the worst thing to sort of own a reptile that ate insects but um, it's pretty easy now I think out of all the insects I detest the crickets the most I, they scuttle around and they smell horrible if you don't clean them out properly I mean you don't have to clean these out like every couple of days I mean some of the things go mouldy and you just pull them out the bottom of the tanks normally okay I get a piece of kitchen roll and wipe that up but obviously um, after a week they really will need changing or if you get through the bugs quicker and obviously before you put fresh ones in you don't put fresh ones in until you've cleaned this tub out and then you start again I've actually got a couple of tubs so when these ones are nearly gone if I've bought the new ones ready they can go in the other tub just makes sense look out for my other video I'm going to do some more on how to store cowkey worms and morio worms amongst other things so thanks for watching